So guys, for the first method, you're gonna head over to search and type in the voice manager. Click on it. And then once you're on this, you're gonna click on your computer name one time, then you're gonna click on view, and then click on show hidden devices. And now you're gonna click on action, and then click on scan for hardware changes. See if that works for you. And now for the second method, you're gonna head over to search again and type in CMD, then you're gonna run it as administrator. And then click on yes. And then once you're on this, you're going to type in msdt.exe space dash id space device diagnostic. Click on enter. Now you want to run this. So click on next. Wait for this to load. If you see your touchpad listed here, then you want to select it. If you don't see it, then you want to select I don't see my device listed. And you just want to follow through all the steps that will come up. See if that works for you. And now for the next method, you want to head over to search and type in check for updates. Click on it. And now once you're on this, you want to click on check for updates, make sure that your computer is fully up to date. Another thing that you could also try is you can check your BIOS and then see if there's an option for you to enable your touchpad. And now for the last method, you just want to restart your computer. Hopefully that will fix your problem.